so I'm just coming on. My sister wanted me to like come on, so I was like, all right, let me just come on. We're gonna do first of the month card pulls. It's the first of the month. Get up, get up, get up. Jenny didn't even tell me she was on. That's the crazy part, uh, Aaron. Ain't that some crazy shit? Jenny ass ain't even tell me she was on last night. That's crazy. That's wild. And Jenny, you my motherfucking friend. You my motherfucking I'm just playing. I'm just playing. <laughs> you need to tell me when you come on so I can mind for you. Let me add Tiff. Let me see. How do I add Tiff here? Tiff requests. It's like I add you. I don't know how to do that. Okay, I, I'll, I'll let you know, Jen. Let me get my girl up on here. We are doing free card pulls. I don't know how to invite people on. Okay, friend, I'm going to show you. I was, I was supposed to call you. I was so tired. I did five readings yesterday, mediumship readings, and I was drained as fuck. I was so tired. Um, Tiff, request to come in. How do I do that? about to die. That's crazy. I just got here. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I think I did it. Hi, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are new here, welcome. Tap the screen. Tap the screen. Show some love. Let's vibe tonight. Let's vibe tonight. Like, I'm going to be here all night. I'm supposed to be watching scary movies with my kids tonight. Ooh, they mad at me. So, yeah. I'm on my iPad. Welcome, everybody. Any of my friends. Thank you, Aaron. Finally, I almost Thank died. you guys for coming on. We're gonna do some card pulls. Um, and if Spirit wants me to bring forward someone, I can do that. Or pause and do like some mediumship, maybe. Um, but yeah, you think they're gonna rise from the dawn? I say it will end well. I'm 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 gonna I'm not go off. <laughs> Y'all see him? Y'all go show him some love. Hector Herrera. He said, "I'm the daughter of Satan." I bet you he I bet you he loved Jesus too. Talking like this. Uh oh. Who he's trying to freak you, out? Uh, no. I bet you he loved Jesus. <laughs> he's so awesome, bro. Christians for the win. Yo, I used to be I used to be Christian, but I I was never like that. Never. Ain't no Christian to talk like that. <laughs> I've never seen so many Christians. Y'all give Hector some love. He wants some attention. Give him his five seconds of attention real quick. That's what he wants. My question is how I didn't die. I didn't die, Jenny. You can hear me? Uh huh. My question is, how do they find us? Girl, if I don't know. And why would they talk how you found me? Why would they talk to the daughter of Satan? Huh? I said, and why would they want to talk to the daughter of Satan? I don't know, child. They feel like they the ones who's going to win you, win you over. Listen, that was hilarious. That man said, you think taking advice from the daughter of Satan? The daughter of Satan? You sound very... And it's, I heard the satanic, so I don't even like that. <laughs> I started doing more research about what they demonized, and I'm like, oh, these people are not... Not that bad. From you should have seen my face when I learned about atheists. I was like, oh, I thought atheists were devil worshippers and ignorance is bliss. That's why the Bible say, if you're here from, you're here, you're from the religion. Yes, um, the Bible say my people perish because of lack of knowledge. Knowledge. Ooh, lack of knowledge. Why you don't know your word? Why are you in my coming side? You want me to preach? <laughs> you want me to preach? That's why I was like, ooh, hey, here we go. And it begins. The daughter of Satan, bitch. That's what he said. <laughs> Girl, that's funny. That's funny. I said, wow, knowledge is power. That's right, Ariana. Knowledge is power. Come on. People care about the lack of knowledge. That's a word right there. Study to show thyself approved. Well, did he do any studying? He ain't study shit. Talking like that. That's coming out of your mouth right now? Study to show 
your thyself exactly your shelf approved and then yourself. i got one i got one more for you you ready mm -hmm. when in the bible when it talks about how it say depart from me i never knew you guess what he wasn't talking to the non-believers he was talking to the christians they ain't ready for that. They're not ready oh, for that. Let me get out. Let me stop. Hold on. I'm just clearing my energy. That's it. Ariana, exactly. They talk about spiritual like they don't rituals. Blind. Just blind. Just blind. You and what you heard. You don't even know for real. Cool. I didn't learn the, the meanings of these scriptures until I left the church. Come on. Come on. I didn't, I didn't understand. I was like, hold up. He was never talking to the 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 jews and he wasn't he wasn't talking to them he was talking to the church he said they're gonna be coming before me lord lord i did this in your name and he said depart from me i never knew you he wasn't listen don't be worried about my soul i'm worried about yours because you're the one who think you're doing right the, the log <laughs> in your eye you worry about the prick in my eye the log in your eye that is, that is not of god that is not of love Love draws people to God. Well, what are you talking about, sir? The other part, too. Can I give you one more? Can no, I give you one more? Draw them to these readings? Okay, yes. Can I give you one more? Mm -hmm. The Bible say, I have to get in my um, Madeira. The Bible say, if you had love, I wouldn't even need to give you any gifts. Come on. That's, the, that's what the Bible say. If you was to truly show love. You wouldn't even have to worry about calling yourself a prophet, a teacher. I wouldn't give you no gifts if you had love. So why do you think you got the authority to come and be worried about my soul? You have the gift because you don't have love. I'm you don't have a heaven or hell to put me in. You don't. <laughs> How in the world you depressed, but you ready to rebuke me? Can you rebuke the depression that's off you? Oh, sorry. We not here for that. Go ahead. Where are these cards at? Let me pull them. I'll try not to laugh because I feel like I just want to be like, and Buddy already, Sally done blocked Buddy. I was going to let Buddy ride oh, out. Sally, let them <laughs> stay. Let them stay. I got scriptures. <laughs> Our belly is full of scriptures. They not ready. They don't know where we came from, so they can say those type of things. But they about to get a, a reality check. Let me put Let me put some scriptures in your ass. I was like, not today, Satan. This is Sally. I was on my uh, Facebook feed and I just seen a lot of people in church and I forgot people go to church on Saturdays too. I forgot. So I was like, oh yeah, I forgot about the seven day events and the Sabbath and all, you know, people that go to church on Saturdays. So my feed was looking crazy. And I was like, I'm gonna go on tomorrow. Cause I thought about when we went on and somebody came and was talking crap on a Sunday to us. And we were like, ain't you supposed to be focusing on the word? You on TikTok at church? <laughs> that was hilarious. Okay, so we're going to pull cards for you guys. First of the month cards. First of the month cards. Cards that will edify you. You will use for edification for yourself for the first of the month. Today is July 1st. A lot of people are expecting. A lot of people are expecting a lot. And um, are very hopeful for the month to come. Or this month already. So... Go ahead and put your name in the chat. I'll do a list. Put your name in the chat. And I'll pull a card. Um, your name and your and where you're from, and we can go. We can go there. They come by the church. Like, how come? Like, how I come out of? <laughs> ready to f shit up. <laughs> They sure do. They ain't get nothing from what what did the what did the pastor say today? The pastor told you to come bother me? Absolutely not. Okay. They know during the sermon all they was thinking about what they gonna eat for dinner. Right. And, and it's scrolling on TikTok. Missing all the word, all the message. Honey. I wrote you down, honey. Sarah. So I got Jay, Aaron, honey, Sarah. Sarah from Texas. I got I got Aaron already. I got you, Aaron. Um, how, many cards, how many cards to pull? Uh, whatever, whatever your heart's desire, sir. You can do one, you can do two. It's a message for them for the month. I said free card pull, but 
L. J and L, I got you down. Okay, so this is your message messages for the month of July. I think I'm going to start doing this on the first of the month. Prayfully, I am on here on the first of every month for the next six months. And it is so. <clears throat> and it is so. Um, Sally, I got you. Hey, Tika. All right, so we're going to stop here. J, Aaron, Honey, Sarah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. Okay, Ray, I got you. And Ariana, okay. I'm going to do, this is the first 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, that's nine. That's nine people. All right, so let's go ahead and pull. We're going to pull for you guys. What spirit has to say for you for this month of July? I know I love to use my spirit deck. This deck right here is my spirituality deck. And I thank you guys for tapping the screen. We already had 3,000. Thank you. Thank you. Tomorrow I will not be on. I probably won't. I'm going to try, but I won't be on because I'm going horseback riding with my other sis. I told you that. Don't look like that. I told you already. Okay, because I'm going to say what you're not going to do to me on this live. Is embarrassed. You came to embarrass me in front of my friends. You're not gonna do that. All right, so I'll start and then Tiffany will finish the message for each person. All right, we're gonna start with Jay. Because I think you're gonna have the, the, the right hook after I have to say my message. All right, Jay, this is your message. Oh, I hate doing that. I keep forgetting to do that. Thank you guys for sharing. Thank you guys for sharing. All right, Jay, trust your intuition. Don't question your instincts. The vibes you're picking up are real. The vibes you're picking up on are real. Okay, put your name in the chat and I'll add you. You'll be my 10th person. K, the letter K. All right, Jay, so yeah, Kalia. I hope I said that right. Kalia. All right, Kalia. I mean, not Kalia. So, Jay, your message for the month of July is tapped into your intuition. This entire month of July, your intuition will increase. Your instincts will increase. Your gut feeling will increase. The vibes you're picking up on around people will increase. Okay, this is giving me empathic vibes. Third eye. Look at the third eye for, for this card. Third eye. Is about to open up a little bit more. You're about to get a more of a peek of what's to come. So pay attention. That's your message for the month of July. Your intuition is about to increase. All right. Cool. Cool. I'll have my first 10. Um, if you want to hang out, cool. You can, and I can add you as the next person on the list. Thank you. Thank you, Sally. I forgot Sally's here. Thank you, Ray. That was my message for um, Jay. Go ahead. Huh? You got to cue me. You got to cue me. Oh, your turn. Yeah, I'm done. Oh, okay. That was, I said, that was your message, Jay. <laughs> this camera on me? This on you. <laughs> that was messages. That was Jay. Okay, thank you. I hope it resonates with you. I prepare for your month. And you said this is for Jay? Yes. All right. Jay. <clears throat> For this month, you'll be introduced to prospects, securing your future. Wise spending is recommended. Uh, speculation, acquire, compound, and fund. What stood out to me was the wise spending. This month, don't just willy-nilly be on the Amazon. I know they got Prime Day coming up. That's not for you. That's not for you. Prime Day, I want you to skip it. Okay, I know you have a few things that's in the cart just sitting and waiting. Go ahead and move it to the line. Just move it to a list. 
You're welcome to share your list for the month of July. I don't know why. Amazon she got me too, Jay. She got me too. <laughs> but Prime Day, you saw my face. I'm like, was that message supposed to hit me too? Because I felt that. I felt that for me. She's a girl. Y'all know me well. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, it says for this. It's just for this month, okay? It's saying to secure your future. I don't know what's coming in, but um, if you have to not be on Amazon this month, I think that's a small ask for what's going to be sent to you. Okay, so Amazon, limit that. Prime Day is not for you, sweetheart. That's the message. <clears throat> I hope that resonates with you. I know it's going to be hard because my hands are shaking. My hands are shaking about that. <laughs> Go ahead. We have Aaron next. Aaron. Aaron, message for you, Aaron. Y'all keep tapping the screen. We thank you. Yeah, I'm not gonna do Prime Day. Okay, Jay. <laughs> yeah, I think I might not do Prime Day either. And I hit every year. I do Prime. Ooh, that kind of hit me. All right, message received. Hmm. <laughs> 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 What she say? You laugh. No, I'm laughing at the comments. Hit the flow. <laughs> Hit the wall. Aaron, message for you. Pay close attention. You need to listen to what you hear. Pay close attention to what you're hearing. Beings from other realms speak through you. Speak through you often. Okay, so pay attention to what you hear in the next this next month. Okay, and heighten your heighten your sensitivity to what you're hearing. Okay. That's their spirit message for the month of July. Okay, Aaron, for you, two cards popped out. It just popped out, and the two cards that came up, the first one was transition, transition, ending and beginning. Um, it says new job, quit, fired, moving, lost income, inherit, and hospice. But the part that stands out to me is the moving um, I don't know if you are looking to move or trying to decide if you're going to move, but right now the month of July is a transitional period. There's some decisions you've been sitting on and you need, it's time for you to literally weigh out your pros and cons and make a decision. It's time for you to transition. No more sitting in limbo about those decisions. And the second card that came up, it says right now, uh, this month will be dedicated to healing money blocks healing money blocks so you need to reprogram you need to be open to receive and also be doing your shadow work because your relationship with money has been an issue the last couple of months um so what it's saying here is healing money blocks is what's your theme for this month when it comes to your finance and you need to do some shadow work specifically when it comes to your relationship with money if you are simply asking for money to spend no, you need to understand that, understand that you are asking for money, yes, to cover a need, but you also need to step into a season of reserve. May that, uh, I hope that reading resonates with you, sweetheart. And that's your reading for the month. That is your July 1st, first of the month message from Spirit, okay, Aaron? And you say you are starting to, you found out you're a clear audience. Yeah, start to listen. Put yourself in meditation a lot. So you can get into the frequency of what you need to hear. Oh, thank you, Tika. Thank you. Thank you, Sally. All right, we have honey next. Honey. <sighs> Message for honey. All right, honey. This is your message for the month july fertility bringing dreams to life mega 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 major growth and progress and we know with ain't no possible pregnancy but you're gonna be pregnant with purpose uh, pregnant with a purpose okay so go ahead and manifest some things with what is it the full moon is coming so release this full moon and begin to prepare for your manifestation for this well hold on is honey still here <laughs> I think she's still here. Um, that's your message, honey. Prepare, prepare, prepare. This is your first of the month reading. Some, okay, something great is about to happen for you. You have set your goals and then allow it to come into fruition for this month of July. That's the message I have for you, First Spirit. 
Honey, the message I received for you is vigilance. Look for opportunities. Keep going. Don't quit. Make your own luck. The path is lit. What stands out the most is make your own luck. Because many times, one of the cards that keep coming up is the fact that you are, you have options, you have decisions to make, you're highly intuitive, you are gifted, and it's all about you doing your own way, right? So right now, it's saying for the month of July, be vigilant about what you are doing. Make sure you are not quitting. You're going to keep going so that way you can see the following month, the outcome of that. So this month is vigilance for you. So yes, you are pregnant with purpose and whatever you need to birth forth, you need to be vigilant about it. I hope that message resonates with you. All right, we have Sarah. Sarah, thank you guys for tapping the screen. We are almost at 10,000 likes. I appreciate y'all. I love you guys. And thank you guys. If you guys want deeper readings, you can always go into our bio and um, book us for a deeper reading. The Dream Decoder, my sister here, she decodes dreams. And um, Tarot, on this, she does a lot. And she's been catapulted in this. So I am very proud of her. And... Um, let me go with Sarah. Sarah, I was like, let me go back to the reading so I can get this list going. All right, Sarah, this is your message. This is your fucking message for July. Girl, detox. A fast detox will bring you the clarity you need. I'm going to just vibe on that. Spirit's telling you it's time to detox, my love. It's time to detox, okay? You are intuit intuitive as well, but our pineal gland is really calcified because of all the things that we do eat. You need to put yourself in a place where you can meditate, okay? You need to start drinking things or, uh, how can I say this? Spirit, just, just say it. All right, you need to drink more water. Hey, Jojo, look at my puka poo. Hi, Jojo. You need to drink more water, love. Girl, you feel right. I feel that. You, you have to drink some more water. You need to drink water. If you got to drink a gallon a day or however much you feel that you need to take a day, you need to drink more water. Three, four, five bottles of water. Make sure that it's alkalinic water. Make sure it's alkalinic water. It's, it'll help with the detoxing, okay? I feel too. I feel too that you probably need to cut back on... Um, technology tv like i think you need to pull away from it a little bit pull away from it a little bit detox from the tv as well because it, it the things that we watch the things that we see through our eye gates it comes and it penetrates our thoughts and change the way we think but lemon water works for detoxing too thank you jay and i just saw something that my brother sent me that showed me cucumbers and cucumbers and lemon i was like what you trying to say but I got the message that I could too because I got to drink more water too because I'm like breaking out because I love Coke. Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola TikTok. <laughs> and my face is starting to break up a little bit, break out a little bit because of it. So I definitely am taking that message for myself. I need to cleanse and get rid of some of this junk in my system. All right. And that's your message from me. <sighs> now I can go ahead and pass it off to Tiff. All right, Sarah. Message for the month. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, can you take a couple of deep breaths for me, sweetheart? Sarah, take a couple of deep breaths. Give me these. All right. A message for Sarah. Thank you, baby. Okay. All right. So, Sarah, what popped out for you? Okay, what popped out for you? For the month of July, you ready? Cause this is pretty big. I was hearing, I was hearing this many, but it popped out for a reason. Patience, gifts, adventure, the matrix, lone wolf, and nourish. Those cards popped out, so I'm gonna make this really quick for you. Okay? Um, I don't know what's going on, but as far as for patience is concerned, none of the things that you are asking for is gonna come via the microwave blessings. You, what you're asking for are not microwavable, okay? This is stuff that needs to cook. So this month, practice patience, sweetheart. There are a lot of things that's going to come to you in gifts. And also while you're at it, you're allowed one adventure. 
one adventure. I'm not saying you only need one adventure. I'm saying do something you haven't done, something that will excite you and put you in a high vibrational state. Because the waiting game kind of weighs us down. And when things take too long to come, a little a little down, you know, a little down about it. We start doubting. The reason you get in that way is because you're not excited and new about something. So while you're looking around and you are grateful for where you are, but the adventure side of you needs to be out there. You need to go ahead and just be like, okay, let me get myself high vibrational because while you are getting your 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 while you're trying to manifest what you're asking for what will happen is you will be high vibrational and be in a position to receive right now that waiting game kind of gets you a little down the matrix it's letting me know that because things have slowed down it's like an illusion you're like maybe it's not gonna work out for me no it's not gonna, it's working out for you it's just an illusion right and then it says lone wolf not everybody needs to know what you're asking about okay um, you don't need to be telling everybody what you're looking for. All right. No, no need to do that. And nourish. It just is confirmation on what Ermi has said. That water, go ahead and infuse it. That was confirmation. That's why she brought it up. Spirit led her to say that because you need to have it infused so that we can start going ahead. The first thing that you're going to see for the month of July, if you hear spirit and do what spirit tells you to do, which is drink that water, you're going to start seeing your skin clear up. That is the message that I have for you, Sarah. I hope that message resonates. All right, message is for Jay. Jay, you're up next. I know it's a lot of people in here and I've been trying to practice doing spirit-led mediumship. Jay, if you're here, are you still here? Put a heart in the chat if you're still here. I'm halfway there. Sorry, that's my phone. It always does that because I have it plugged in. Right when you take a breath, I'm halfway there. Okay. <laughs> Hey, I was thinking of um, this male energy here, um, a slim guy, and he's showing me himself cutting grass. And I'm like, come on now, everybody cut the grass. Everybody cut. I mean, a lot of men cut grass. But um, he just keeps telling me to say that, say that. And you'll know who that is. But I have a card for you. This is your July 1st. This is your July 1st message, Jay. Wait, I think I had Jay already. Jay, didn't I read for you already? Oh, Lord. Jay, this, I don't know why this came to, I wrote your name twice, so we can ask somebody else, um, Sally. I wrote Jay names twice. Jay, I don't know if you have this person in spirit. It's a slim man, and I keep seeing his sideburns. Then he keeps showing me himself cutting the grass. I don't know if he have a lawn service. <sighs> Whoever this is, he just like saying, hey. All right, I'm gonna go for it. His message is for L. Jay, whoever this is, he's just giving like a wink, saying, hey, he's around. Okay. L. This is for you, L. Get out of Jay's energy. Okay. Try to get out of Jay's energy. This is your message, L, for the first of the month, okay? July message from Spirit. Okay. L. Good news, good news, good news, okay? Um, unexpected, positive outcome. Many good things are coming. So expect that good news, something that you wish and something that you really, really want. Whatever your heart's desire is, spirit is saying that it's coming. You have good news coming your way, love. So prepare for that and be joyful in that. Be grateful in that. Honor yourself in that. Celebrate it, okay? Celebrate it. Sometimes when we get good news, we never really celebrate it. So I want you to be in a place of receiving it and then celebrating that good news. You know, you don't have to share it with everybody. You can share it with your closest friends, you know? But um, this is giving me so much peace already. Oh, L, good news is coming, friend. 
just know that and honor yourself when it does come and you don't have to share it like i said with anybody you don't have to share with anybody or you can share it with your closest ones the ones that are like yeah dog I listen and they got your back and they're actually truly happy for you you know you got some snakes around that just they ain't gonna be that happy so be careful with who you tell your business to all right but good news is coming love and i'm excited for you all right go ahead Tua. Ooh. The message I have for you, Elle. Ooh. I won't hide it. All right, Elle, the message that came up is protection. It says, save your money. Okay? Right? It says, save your money. The rest of the card is not coming up for me. It's saying, save your money, which is just letting me know. I think, believe, because my deck is majority uh, looking at finances and um, some some things when it comes to just us. So for this month, um, I don't know if you was here earlier, but you too. Prime Day is not for you this month. Prime, Skip Prime Day, okay, sweetheart? You, 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 you don't, go ahead. Don't don't worry about it. So yes, ma'am, no prime day for me. <laughs> Look, Amazon about to come on TikTok. Get off this. <laughs> you messing with my money, too. You Not messing with, with my, my money. money. Is them cards on me? No prime day. But I hope that message resonates with you. You need to go ahead and protect your finances. So that just lets me know. That, that means just be mindful of what you're spending because what you are about to receive, you need to have the mindset to manage what you're about to get. Whatever you've been asking for. Sorry, sir. Jay, I remember why, I, I don't know why I put your name back on, but I remember Spirit telling me to pull this karma card for you. That's what it was. Come so on, Jay, man. this karma card, I just bought this deck. Um, a little quick thought out of it because I was like, I like the... Um, always add a little bit of judge to some of the readings this came up for you text someone to say that you're thinking about them that could be something you can do <laughs> i know right that could be something you can do for your month your good deed of the month just say hey i was thinking about you how you doing just checking on you you know so that's what spirit because i'm like this card for jay okay and then i just look i'm like i got jay twice text somebody to let them know that you're thinking about them okay for the month of July, that's gonna be your good deed. Thank you for watching, and if you would like to book a reading, go to the link in my bio.